Breaking news, new evidence, and a person of interest in the Oakland County child killer investigation. Let's get right to 7 Action News investigator Heather Catallo. And Heather, you were the first to tell us that they were looking at someone who was still alive in this case. What are they telling us today? Well, that's right. This is a new person of interest. Prosecutors just passed out his picture, and they said they need your help. The Oakland County prosecutor is asking if you remember anything about this man, Arch Sloan. Sloan is now 70 years old and serving a life sentence in Michigan for criminal sexual conduct. Prosecutor Jessica Cooper announced today that evidence found in Sloan's 1966 Pontiac Bonneville matches hairs that were found on two of the Oakland County child killer victims. Sloan is being called a person of interest in the case. Between 1976 and 1977, a killer abducted and murdered four children in Oakland County. After the first murder, detectives were tipped off to Sloan and they searched his Bonneville. The investigators took tapings from the interior of the car and on those tapings were small hairs, fibers, and fur. Hairs found on the two male victims, Timothy King and Mark Stebbins, were analyzed by the FBI's lab in Quantico, and they have the same mitochondrial DNA profile as a hair that was recovered from Sloan's Bonneville. That testing, however, revealed that the hairs do not come from the driver of that vehicle. The driver of that vehicle is not the donor of either the hair found in the Bonneville or the hairs found on the boys. Sloan would have been 34 at the time of the first murder. The child killer task force has crossed the country and the state to figure out who the hairs belong to and to determine their connection to Sloan. Cooper says Sloan was also known to drive a 1969 black Chevy pickup and a 1971 blue Ford pickup. If anyone recognizes Sloan or the vehicles, the task force wants to hear from you. Once again, the hair does not match Arch Sloan, but detectives want to know if anybody remembers who this man associated with back in the 1970s, and they want to hear from you. They've set up a hotline. That number is 1-800-442-7766. Now, Sloan has an extensive criminal history. I'll tell you more about what we've learned about that coming up tonight on Action News at 6. For now, reporting live at the Oakland County Prosecutor's Office in Pontiac, I'm Heather Catalo, 7 Action News.